Well, Josh and Kendall, today is a great day, isn't it? They've been looking forward to for a long time. There's no other day like it. It's a day you'll never forget. It's a day that you'll find yourself thinking about from time to time for the rest of your life. This is a forward-looking day, a day when you'll make the promises to God and to one another that will stake out the pattern that will mark your life as a married couple. to observe today goes way back. It's literally as old as the hills. It goes all the way back to the time of creation. On the sixth day of creation week, God created the first man, Adam. God saw that it was not good for Adam to be alone, so God made a helper suitable for him. God put Adam into a deep sleep, took one of his ribs, and God made Eve and brought her to Adam. When Adam saw her, he said, This is now bone of my bones and flesh of my flesh. She shall be called woman because she was taken out of man. And we're told that for this cause, a man shall leave his father and his mother and shall cleave to his wife, and they shall become one flesh. That was the first marriage ceremony performed by none other than God himself. Josh and Kendall, as you have made these covenant commitments before God in this congregation, by the authority given to me by the state of Indiana, I pronounce you husband and wife. Therefore, what God has joined together, let no man separate. Joshua may kiss the bride.
When you look at me just like I'm yours, yeah. I never felt like this before. You make me feel the way I ain't feel in a minute. I feel like I'm living when I'm looking at you, baby. Never felt like this before. You gave me butterflies in my tummy like you do. You just give me love and like I can only get from you. Yeah. They doing that in my lungs. Cause you are the only one to give me butterflies in my tummy like you do. And you do. You go. 